Well, when I first started at Memorial, I started doing work in uh, research work in safety of life at sea. And this is motivated by a desire to actually have an impact on improving safety of life at sea. Making things. Making things work. Making life better. Ideas without boundaries. I cannot imagine being a professor without teaching. I taught a course on um, um, signal processing. It was a senior undergraduate course, and it was a pleasure to work with all the students, but um, uh, my today's stories is related uh, only to one of them, uh, Uzma Khan. Her crave for knowledge, um, her enthusiasm and joy in finding and applying new concepts uh, it really inspired me. Uh, now uh, she is with uh, Research in Motion, um, working in the area of wireless communications. And uh, I think that I uh, learned something from her. Now I use joy and enthusiasm in my work, in all my work, in teaching, but also in research. And uh, I just teach that to students. And it always, always pays off. Warm. I'd be in Houston and it'd be a little, you know, I'd be doing some Excel or I'd be doing some of the database program there and my boss who would sit, he sat right behind me and we had, you know, a really great working relationship and he would, he would help me and he was really interested in what I wanted to learn and he would, he would take what I wanted to learn and really make me a part of the team. There were times that he would say, okay, haul on your work boots and your hard hat, we're going out to the shop and we're, we're gonna look at some of the, the equipment that you're helping design or you're helping refurbish. You know, they'd, they'd incorporate me into meetings with the client or, or with a potential client and that made me feel really um, like I was a part of the team, the engineering team, and I never felt really that I was a student. I felt like I was a student, but I felt like I was more than a student. I felt like I was an employee, and I felt like I was an engineer. Madrock Marine Solutions was started by another one of my graduate students, uh, Dean Pelly. Dean is from Deer Lake originally. Uh, while he was my graduate student, he made it known to me that he was interested in starting a company. In fact, he and one of his, uh, his uh, undergraduate pals started a company while he was still a graduate student. He had worked as a co-op student in different places, but his first job upon graduating uh, was really as president of his own company. Subsequently, they designed and are now manufacturing life-saving appliances. These are, uh, in effect, it's a better release mechanism for lifeboats, and they've really done a wonderful job uh, getting into this market, which is very tough international market. They've competed nose to nose with some very big companies and they've, they've done very, very well for themselves. In fact, I would say that they are currently uh, the best technology in the world for what they're doing and they're having a big impact on the safety of life at sea because of it. Faculty of Engineering and Applied Science. Making a better world by design.